Melanie Wilkinson with YorkNewsTimes.com. Um, we're in the area of Walnut and York Avenues on Saturday morning as the York Fire Department is undergoing a training exercise. Now there's a house here that's unlivable and they're going to burn it to the ground after they do a, a series of training. Uh, we talked with York Fire Chief Mike Lloyd about the purpose of this and also an idea that he'd like to see for the future. Today is a live fire training burn here on Walnut Street for a house that is uh, no longer livable. We are using it to get firefighting experience for all of our people because we don't get a lot of fires in York, thankfully. And we uh, are able to use it to get that experience, interior firefighting, wearing all of their gear with limited visibility. If we were to have a training facility someplace in the city, then we would be able to do this on a monthly or every other month basis in a controlled environment. In this environment here, it's not controlled. We, I mean, we control it the best we can, but it's not the safest place for doing training burns where we can help people learn to operate in that environment. In a training facility, it would be more than just a burn facility. It would be a place where we could do practice all of our ladder operations and, and uh, practice our operations with our apparatus where we flow water and we're not disturbing anybody. And then we can control that environment. It's a controlled environment for us. After all the training was completed, um, they let the house go up in flames. They also burned uh, two accompanying sheds. Now I'm told that because this area is in the floodplain and the owner is working with the city, this area will become city property um, once this whole area has been cleared. Again, this is Melanie Wilkinson with YorkNewsTimes.com.